So my name is Carl Erickson. I'm the president and the co-founder of Atomic Object. Atomic Object is a software product development company. We specialize in building new and uh, custom software products for huge multinationals and tiny web startups and everyone in between. So we got started in, the, uh, in September of 2001, my partner Bill and I. Uh, I was formerly a professor at Grand Valley State University in the computer science department and was looking for an opportunity to uh, branch out in a new career and gathered some of my best students of the past 10 years around me and uh, started using these agile practices, agile software development practices, and we are up to 23 people now. Our customers range from uh, large companies like World Bank and Chrysler down to web startups, Catalog Choice, Relius, and uh, across a wide variety of domains because we specialize in software craftsmanship, not any particular technology or domain. Our office environment is very important to us. We bought this building six years ago so that we can control things like how the room is laid out and access to light and space, and fresh air and all that good stuff. Um, the environment's very open. It promotes creativity and collaboration. Um, very important, all of our work is together, down at the micro level, pair programming, two people, one computer, and up to the team level. Um, nothing's done solo here. It's personally very rewarding to me, the fact that we have 23 very smart people, mostly between the ages of 21 and, and uh, early 30s, and that we're located right here in the central core of the city. Um, over half the people who work here either walk or ride their bike to work. Uh, we're committed to the city in that regard. We do a lot of community stuff, uh, let our downstairs space be used. So we feel very much a part of developing Grand Rapids and moving it into what Grand Rapids and Michigan in general needs a lot more of. Uh, which is knowledge workers and uh, exporting the sort of the holy grail of service export. Last year, 40% of our revenue came from out of state. So we're basically selling our services to companies in California and on the East Coast. I think there is opportunity in Grand Rapids right now. I, I think sometimes uh, my out of state friends and relatives, for example, think about Michigan, they think about a horrible situation, and I don't see that in Grand Rapids so much. I see construction cranes, and I see opportunity, I see entrepreneurial spirit, and I see companies with world competitive markets, um, are competitive in world markets, products that are competitive. So it feels, like, it feels like a different place than what I'm reading about in the newspapers. 